Hi everyone, welcome to my second recording vlog. Screwdriver, orange juice, vodka. It's actually more vodka than anything else. And some frozen berries. Hashtag delicious. I don't know where to go. I honestly don't know how to make an intro. Let's just get the f into it anyway. I downloaded a vocal track from, uh, I'll put the website in my link in the description, uh, but it's a great place to, it's a great resource to find royalty free uh, vocal tracks or uh, free uh, vocal samples. So this is what it sounds like. There's no lights, all dark, but no matter what It's a really nice vocal stay track. Stay it's clean and it gets pretty the aggressive. Louder, and we're showered in drops of wave. Okay, so it sounds it sounds great. For my taste, it's a little too ear piercing. So I'm gonna clean it up and add a little bit of uh, uh, EQ and a little bit of distortion. Just give it a little bit more grit. Or post post processing. The beat's louder and we're showered in drops of wave pulsations and I I added a pretty good amount of filth to the vocal, then added uh, this chamber based reverb, and that's that gives it that spacey sort of sound. Okay, so we're gonna work off of that. So after this, I'm gonna add some drums. Now, as I grow this channel, I'm gonna try to be more uh, and be more original with, especially drums. Drums are like percussion, rhythm. It's not my forte. I am really good with melody and harmony. So anything on the keyboard or the guitar, I'm really good at. But drums, percussion, I freaking suck. So I will be working on that, hopefully, as I grow this channel. And hopefully you guys can see that in my future videos. So here it is with some kick drum. But no matter what you choose to stay here with me The beat's louder and we're showered And drops of wave pulsations and I Sounds pretty damn good. So what I did next is I chopped up the vocals a little bit more. So I don't want to use a, the vocal as a whole. I want to chop it up because I feel like there's a little bit more originality if I do a little bit of chopping and kind of mix around the vocals in my own way. In this video, I'll be using one main instrument, which has always been my favorite, my go-to synth, Omnisphere. All hail the great <laughs> Omnisphere. King of synths, honestly, no debate to me. <laughs> so don't try to convince me otherwise. I love Omnisphere. I like to use uh, the presets in Omnisphere. What's the point of having 50 plus gigabytes that people developed <laughs> if you're not going to use them? Hmm. Okay, so the first one is called Alternate Force Lead. Right, with an arpeggiator on there. The arp is doing this. The pattern is down in 16th notes, in 16th note pattern in legato. Very simple, so... So think of this as a breakdown, getting into the hook, I mean chorus, part B. <laughs> Fantastic vocals. It just, I mean, honestly, this song would be nothing without the vocals, honestly. So on the next part, I'm gonna double this with a second synth, doing the same par uh, arpeggiator pattern. Let me do that right now. This next uh, uh, preset is called Valve Oscillator Instability. And I personally love this one because it's dirty, but it's also fuzzy sounding and, it's not, and it does not pierce the ears. And here it is. Same pattern as the last one, not, nothing very different about it. I like to layer things so they blend, not so much where you can distinguish either one, but it creates a more fuller sound. That's what I'm gonna do. So you can hear the hit of the first synth, of the first preset, and the dirtiness and warmth of the second one. I think everything done so far has been pretty good. I added uh, drums, uh, some bass, some swell effects, uh, arpeggiating synths, and then some poly synths in the background, and this is what it sounds like so far. I leveled up some of the items, EQ'd a little bit, this is a rough cut, but I think it sounds pretty solid. Oh, that arp sent in the background. I like. Loving the synth, 8-bit memories, nostalgia.
What do you guys think? Not so bad, huh? It's actually, I'm actually pretty satisfied with it. Uh, it's, it sounds like something that I will be finishing up in the future. Um, I don't know how to do endings. I don't know how to say goodbye. Ciao. See you later. So I say run.